Hey everyone, this is VGZ with a uh, quick tutorial on uh, how to install the 0011 update. First, you need to download the two files that are in the forum. They're in the post. You need to download uh, Dell Net Thrive 0032 full stock and then also the 0011 update that he has in there. Once you get both of those, you have to unzip them and uh, take the update files name you know one something else and uh or uh, just place them in two different folders so you could get to them once you get into the recovery window but make sure you unzip these once you download them and place the update files on your SD card uh, I've already done that I'm going to show you that I am on a 0032 build right now I tried to install it just by uh, applying the update and I uh, get the Wi-Fi error so I'm going to use the uh, other instructions that were posted in the uh, forum what I'm going to do is uh, shut it down I already have my SD card in there then I'm going to power back up into the recovery Now I'll select a metal box. So what I'm going to do is uh, install zip from SD card and then choose zip from SD card. It's going to be on the external. So I see my update. This is the first one. This is the uh, 0032 update. Uh, the stock you have to do this or your Wi-Fi or that network problem will come up so we're gonna do that we're gonna apply it yes install and uh, as it does this we're gonna sit here and wait for a little bit it should apply very quickly As you can see, it's taking a little bit, but it'll be complete here uh, momentarily. I'm showing all of this and not editing the video because I want everyone to see what I'm seeing once you uh, actually do it. Should be finishing up here. It says flashing ROM is complete. And we do not want to reboot at this point, so what we're going to do is go back. Well, actually, you didn't even have to go back. Um, what you're going to have to do once you go back, hit install zip, choose zip from a card, and find where you put the 0011 update so I know where I put mine and I'm going to install it here I'm going to say yes install okay and it shows it right there that's installing that it's going to take a, a few minutes a couple of minutes to install this as you can see it's moving faster than the other one Down from the 21. Tebow. And the pass 
As you can see, it's moving through it. it. Says update has completed. Now we're gonna do is go back, and we're gonna reboot the system now. It's gonna boot up. Hopefully, we're successful. I believe so because uh, that wasn't my uh, boot animation before. And we're going to wait and sit through the uh, boot animation. See what we got. Now, pay in mind, I did have the uh, modded kernel installed, so that should make a difference because the uh, 0032 stock probably overwritten, overwrote everything that was on there, so. As you can see, it's uh, taking a little bit longer, which they said in the uh, thread there that it's going to take a little while to uh, boot up. Now it's coming up. Once the screen dims, that's when you know that the uh, boot loop is done. All right. Once we get in here, you should see everything. I still have all my apps. It says uh, your SU binary is out of date. Make sure that you do not update that and uh, go in there and take away the updates because if you update the binaries you lose root uh, actually you use uh, lose super user alright everything is seems to be okay there I'm still connected to my internet I'm going to Wi-Fi like I showed you before I had the Wi-Fi error and just to show you that I am up to date We'll see here. I don't have the mod kernel anymore, but I am on the 0011. And just to show you, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's pretty long. I know I'm just rambling on. And I hope this helps someone. Um, give me your comments. This is VGZ. Peace out.